Hey guys, it's Ike and welcome to the first episode of Wonder Egg Priority. Now, I gotta say, I haven't heard too much about this anime. The only time that I actually heard about it was when I got recommended this article that may or may have not said that this anime has taken too much time and money to make, but that's neither here nor there. I did get people recommending me this anime and that they wanted me to react to it. So, you know, here I am. I'll be honest with you, when I first saw the article and I decided to do a quick search into Wonder Egg Priority, I had this feeling that it probably wasn't going to be an anime for me because obviously I have such a refined taste in anime, <laughs> says the person who likes two car. But anyways, we'll see how I feel about this anime once I actually get to experience it. So let us get started. I? I was gonna say, don't you hmm him or her? You're in the middle of the street. So she gave a little barrier for the dead bug. Wait, 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 wait. Was this the, uh, was this an amusement park? Why? Okay, so it is kind of like a park or an amusement park. What? God damn, if only I could chug my water like that. What are you expecting? Biting into an egg. I don't know, it's an egg that you've got by following a flying bug that was supposed to be dead, so... So I assume she was bullied at school and that's why she's at home. Oto. Oh my god, he's a goddamn fucking toilet paper now. Wow, well, since you say so. <laughs> Damn, dude. Gee, don't need to be so rude. Oh, oh, I was, you know, I was just thinking, I'm like, is it an actual person who's going to be inside? But then my brain really just went into, God, imagine all the omelets that you could make. What is this, a fucking battle theme? Uh, 
<laughs> All right, animate. You fucking got me. Is that an exit in the locker? Uh, so I assume when she got hit, like, it actually jumped in- jumped at her with a knife. For the most part, you know? This is like her version of bros over hoes. <laughs> Hello there, mysterious door. We never got that girl's name, huh? I guess I'll just continue calling her in my notes, Egg Girl. Oh. Koito, Koito, okay. Koito Nagase, okay. Sorry, can't hang out with ugly people. Yeah, that's what I expect. <laughs> How long have you guys known each other? <laughs> Her feet?
<laughs> Tell me how salty it is. What is she holding? I thought she was holding two guns, man. Oh, it's still just the axes. Okay. What is this music that is happening right now? Kurumi Saijo. Holy shit, dude, she just I guess I'll continue calling other people a girl or egg boy at this point. <laughs> Wait, if only I is able to be saved at, at the end of the bell, then where the fuck does Kurumi go then? Because she's like, oh, I just need to make it by the time the next the next bell rings. So like what? It's either you pop and vanish into thin air or you get stabbed. <laughs> well, I guess popping and vanishing into thin air is a lot better than... <laughs> Getting fun, getting your he head cracked open with an axe. Oh, okay. God, don't you just hate it when you get up one day and suddenly somebody stab you in the liver? See no evils. Oh, I just realized it's see no evil. Okay. <laughs> I was like, see no evils. So she's dead also. <laughs> Why is it? It's all just washing machines. <laughs> Holy shit, dude, that's a lot of eggs. Okay, wait, there is the gacha machine where you can get eggs. 
But then there are eggs in the washing machines that are, I assume, getting incubated? Like, what are those eggs? Are those the eggs of the statues? Like, what are what, what are these eggs in the fucking washing machine for? <laughs> Shit! Alright, so that was the first episode of Wonder Egg Priority. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comments down below. You know that I always like talking to you guys. Yeah, I thought that this was a, a, a really good first episode. Really caught my attention. You know, all you really need is some fucking psycho coming in with a fucking axe. And it just gave me that feel, that vibe of High Rise Invasion. And I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm down for a similar-ish anime. And especially with uh, the, the characters, how like you only see their lips and everything else is blurred out it just gave me a bit of a feeling of high-rise invasion of like all the mask people and that was the thing that i really enjoyed about high-rise invasion i'm talking about the manga we do not talk about the fucking anime all right <laughs> back to wonder egg priority man i do not believe that fucking bullshit of saying oh if you continue saving other egg people you'll also save your friend all I see at this point is, it's not about the ending, it's about the journey. <laughs> oh, what are all these Wonder Egg shit? They really just tossed you into this world. And, well, they, they toss you into this world without any fucking answer. It's just kind of like, all right, here you go, have an egg. You're in the dream world now. Break that egg. The egg turned into somebody. And then you're suddenly being chased by see no evils. And you just gotta, you just gotta survive until the the bell rings or, you know, until this certain time limit is up. I don't know. So like after this world, this, the fucking egg people, they're now egg people. The, do these egg people, they just go back and become an egg again. And then somebody else goes into the gacha machine and like break and then they get those eggs. But I'll be honest, on paper, it didn't sound as interesting to me. And it's just something that I'm just kind of like, Whatever. I'm kind of glad that I get to see this episode. I wonder what's gonna happen in the in the next episode. Although I feel like I wouldn't say the same thing, but you know, it's just that premise of I'm gonna crack open an egg and now I gotta protect people. And we also did have I wondering, yo, if I crack multiple eggs and I protect multiple people, can I save my friend faster? Which again, I still think is bullshit. So I assume these egg people technically have memories of who they were before they died. We got to learn a little bit more about Ai, and uh, as the summary of Funimation says, she's an introvert, and she also gets bullied because she's different, because of course, you know, that's just how the world works. You're different and not the same as everybody else. Fuck you. <laughs> Welcome to the real world, Ai. Yeah, so she was bullied. She She's an introvert, so she, she doesn't want to talk to people, or she just prefers to be alone, basically. And she ends up making friends with this girl, Koito, who I assume also ends up getting bullied because she was friends with Ai, and that ended up with Koito jumping off of the roof and killing herself. And here we have Ai, who feels like she's responsible for it because she says that she betrayed her in some way, I don't know. Okay, the one thing that really gets me is the fucking soundtrack right now. <laughs> I, we've got some 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 nice like horror s scene. I know that the, the horror tag is in here, but we get some nice horror s scene. It's kind of a similar issue that I kind of have with um, God, what was his animated Parasite? The Maxim, that's what it was called. That was the one issue that I actually had with Parasite was that I thought it was going to be a horror anime, and then in that anime they just started blaring dubstep music. <laughs> Which just takes me out of the anime. And that's kind of what it is with this uh, anime right now, Wonder Egg Priority, where you just have this like a high, high, high intense, not high intense, but high poppy music. It's a little odd, but we'll see how, how I feel about it in the next two or three episodes. So other than that, if I have anything else to say, I will write it in the description down below. I was gonna say something, but my mind completely went blank. But thank you guys for sticking around. And I will see you guys in the next episode.